Good afternoon. My name is Bernie Rickey, and I am president of UAW Local 600 in Dearborn, Michigan, home of the historic Rouge Complex and the Ford Lightning. <laughs> Mr. President, it is my honor to be here with you today. We know that the UAW and Joe Biden have worked together from your earliest days in Delaware, where we supported you in your first run for office. We were there at the beginning, and we are so proud to be here now with our brother in the White House here today. UAW members are excited about the future. The UAW is ready to build these electric cars, trucks, and the batteries that go in them. We know that President Biden has our back. We know he understands that we can grow our industry and preserve and create more good-paying union jobs through his Build Back Better plan. We know that this president understands that as we move towards this bright future, none of us will be left behind, that we are the true engine in making this technology work, grow, and power America's middle class. That is why I'm proud to introduce President Biden today as a UAW member and a proud American. Mr. President, you have our back and we have yours. Thank you, President Biden. Please, everybody sit down. Please, please, please. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. I, uh, before I begin, let me start with something, uh, I apologize, more somber. I, uh, I learned a couple of hours ago when my staff came in that a close friend of mine, and I think of many of you as well, Rich Trumka died today from a heart attack. The reason I was a few minutes late coming out, and I apologize for that, I was talking to his wife and to his son who called. He wasn't just a great labor leader. He was a friend, and his friend of yours too, Debbie, I think. And he's someone I could confide in, and uh, you knew whatever he said he'd do, he would do. It was simple, Tommy. You knew him well as well. He was always there. He was an American worker, always fighting for working people, protecting their wages, their safety, their pensions, and their ability to build a middle-class life. I've also believed that the middle class built America, but I know who built the middle class, unions. Unions built the middle class. There is no doubt that Rich Trumka helped build unions all across this country. My heart goes out to Barbara and Rich Jr. and the grandkids. And uh, I might point out that, uh, you know, uh, I used to always kid him. He was from soft coal country. I was from hard coal country. <laughs> we used to have this thing about, you know, he used to be president of the United Mine Workers. And that's how he got started. 